All right, guys, we're here with the all new Summit X. Check out this color, and it's also accessorized, and I'm gonna take you through some of those right now. So as we uh, move from the front here, you're gonna see we've set this up with the Fox E-Balls. Uh, this is an amazing shock package. It's got the QS3, so one, two, and three right there that you can choose, and also adding uh, air into the chambers to set it up, and you can really find out your adjustments. I uh, have used these uh, for a couple of seasons and absolutely love them. I'm a little more sold on the coilovers just because uh, they're a little more simple. So just put, bolt them on and you've got your QS3 for one, two, or three setting. And uh, these Evols are really nice. It's all about uh, customizing and, and uh, what you like to do. So of course you can check that with your local dealer and decide right there. As we move through here, uh, you'll notice more of us running these hand guards. These are the flexible hand guards, so you can hit trees, roll over your snowmobile. Um, but what's so great about them is that it actually does a little bit of wind deflection on those real cold morning uh, if you're riding in on the trail, and also keeps the snow out of uh, your throttle area as well. Um, so it just allows you to have better control of the snowmobile, which is uh, always really, really important. And of course, um, I always talk about it, but here are the tow holds. So people always wonder why do you need these, but um, the reason is, is when you're down uh, turning or cow carving, uh, you get your foot in there and now you can lift up uh, with your office at side foot and it really hooks you into the snowmobile. The great thing about them is that your boot won't get hooked up like in the past with the footholds. If you stuffed your foot in there and it was a big boot, you could get stuck, which could be uh, an injury waiting to happen if you fall off your snowmobile. With the adjustable ones here, of course, you can adjust them wherever you want. I prefer the rigid ones, again, simplicity, and I find they never uh, hook my boot in if I, if I want to get out. It's no problem and they're also cheaper. So what I tell guys is uh, look at the, the rigid ones, try them out. If, you, if they don't work for you, you can easily find a buddy to sell them to because they're not very expensive. And then move to the adjustable ones, which are a little bit more money, but of course that adjustability. You'll also notice that on the new Summit, um, we've got, talked about it, is now all extruded right up to the front. So stiffer up front, better grip, and of course way better snow evacuation. Um, this also has the running board inserts that stiffen them up even more for those bigger riders or if you're jumping this uh, machine really, really hard. And of course the Carl Kuster 47cc is a must have. One inch lower, one inch narrower and two inches shorter in the, uh, in the seat. People always ask it if it's comfortable. I find the seat extremely comfortable. Of course I really never sit down only for lunch and uh, if I'm resting or taking a shot. Um, we're just hanging out, but the rest of the time I'm standing, and that's why it's so nice to have such a small seat, because when you're hopping around, it really makes a big difference. Here's our 15 liter uh, fuel caddy, and of course it's got the link system on top, so you can add your removable snow flap to it, or extra bags on top, uh, that you're going in um, to an area, and then of course you can drop your fuel and drop that bag, or drop the fuel and put the bag in place of it. So lots of really cool uh, accessories in the catalog that you can check out. So not just ordering your snowmobile, you're actually gonna accessorize it and uh, let your dealer know what you want. Of course, make sure you get your order in before April 14th, 2019 for your 2020 Ski-Doo Snowmobile.